obviously once your customers have purchased a credit bundle or package, they are going to want to redeem those credits towards products in your store. So you'll go over to products, add new, and we'll call this a, a simple credit product. Give it a fancy description. And you'll notice that the Woo Credits plugin adds this field here, price and credits. So let's say that this particular product you want to price as being five credits. Well, we'll save that draft and we'll click preview. And this is what the individual credit, uh, simple credit product page would look like. The title, um, the price that it is five credits, the option to add it to the cart. It notifies the customer that they have 100 credits remaining, gives them an option to buy more, and the fancy description is down here. So when the customer goes to add that to the cart, it will add it, they can check out, and what the WooCredits plugin does is it adds this payment gateway here um, for your customer to check out using those credits. If you want to also present the option to purchase this with currency, you can also enter a currency price, save that draft, we'll look at that product, and now it will be displayed as $10 or five credits. When they go to check out now, it will present to them two options. They can either uh, pay for it traditionally with a credit card or PayPal, or they can select the WooCredits gateway and it will deduct from the credit balance.